So that celebrates Mr. Fab and all that he is, but we've got him live right here. <laughs> we are connected. Good morning, Mr. Fab. We know that you always try to take the light off of you and put it on your community. So as we welcome you into our broadcast this morning, what specifically are the activities that are available in your community that people can get engaged in? Well, y'all trying to make me cry this morning. That was <laughs> touching. Aww. That was dope. <laughs> See my sister on there. Um, man, so for the rest of the week, tonight we're having a huge skating event at the Henry J. Kaiser Center, which has been closed for almost two decades and so to be able to open this up tonight for a skating event that is you know for the public um i'm i'm ecstatic about that tonight's going to be amazing and throughout the rest of the week like we're having a, a sneaker prom which is like a prom where you <laughs> wear your suits and just fly sneakers for those that didn't get a chance to go to prom uh, or those that just miss those moments and want to relive those moments there's a brunch this weekend and a few other events, man. I'm having a super huge black designer fashion show at uh, at my establishment on to, on Broadway, which is called Desi's Lounge, named after my mother. And the whole fashion show is dedicated to up and coming designers that are from our area to have them have an ability to have their clothing line be showcased on the runway. Uh, just another way of what we can get in, anybody in the community engaged and involved. And the thing that I'm looking forward to is this Sunday going back to the alma mater of Oakland Technical High School and having a celebrity basketball game for the children, for the kids, bringing out people, and just going to have a great time. Mm. Uh, it sounds like it's going to be a really fun time. And I love that we highlighted your sister. You just mentioned your mom, too. And, uh, you know, tell me about really just there's always so many negative headlines sometimes coming out of Oakland and just what this means for the community, bringing them together and just bringing some of that brightness and positivity. I just feel like it gives people hope. If one person can see that somebody somebody is there. You're there. Oh You're no. with us. And just like that, he turns into the mural that was just <laughs> painted in Oakland. You're good. No, yes, I think you got good. a future you in TV. Do. Do. I mean, <laughs> if that doesn't say happy birthday, I don't know what does. You know, it's unfortunate because I wanted to ask him when he sees stories. I mean, he's such a pillar of positivity mm -hmm. in the right. community. We've had him on several times talking about you know, if it be his art exhibit or the backpack drive, yeah. and of course this week celebrating his birthday. Yep. But when he sees stories like in and out, mm -hmm. shutting its doors in Oakland, and the main reason is crime. That has to hit home for him. Well, and he does something about it, and we see that value here in the Bay Area play out over and over and over. People using their sphere of influence and stepping forward. You know, we, we saw the guy who has trick-or-treaters turning his house into a Harry Potter house to raise money for the food banks. Mr. Fab, who's joining us now once again. You hit the wrong He's button, back. Mr. Fab. <laughs> you hit the wrong button. But we were just talking as we bring you back here how cool it is. You're a model of saying, I have a birthday. Somebody may have an anniversary. Somebody may want to honor somebody that's passed away. You can turn those days into days of service no different than after the passing of Dr. King. We, we saw that Martin Luther King Day is a day of national service in our country. Tell us more about this idea of using our life, using our sphere of influence, using special days to really make, make it so people can have an avenue to get out and serve. I just want to bring a light to Oakland. You know, it's like we talked about earlier. Um, me and Sean spoke on it. It's it's a dark cloud over our city right now. And it's crazy because I don't see that forecast. When I go out and I see these children, I see stars, I see suns, mm. I see moonlights, mm. I see uh I see the cosmos and, and I believe in these I believe in my city, I believe in the, the entrepreneurs that are here, I believe in the teachers, the educators, I believe in the children. Um I, I believe I believe in a lot of a lot of the the hope, and and maybe I'm just um, maybe I'm just optimistic like that. But I know because I was a person that was given up on. I was a person that wasn't expected to rise above uh, the circumstances that I was born into. And here it is, thriving and 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 enjoying life. Um, and no matter what the situation is, remaining convivial, being able to say, "Hey, man, I'm dealing with it. I'm rolling with the punches, and I and I'm destined to be able to open up a bright spot here in the city and welcome others to do so." Because there are several Mr. Fads out there; they just don't have the opportunity or the networking system to go out and amplify what it is that they're doing. So, if we can bring a lens to what they have going on, mm. I'm pretty sure more people would be engaged to say, "Oakland, not that bad after all." 
Well, Mr. Fab, we appreciate you here on the show for taking the time to join us. And I know Oakland appreciates you. And happy birthday. Yes, happy birthday. I appreciate you guys. And I would love to see you guys come out to any of the events, whether it be the skating tonight or any other events that we have. Um, just to show face, man, and, and the community engagement of showing people this isn't just about Oakland. This is about the Bay Area. And everybody has been coming together. I want to shout out. Uh, Mayor London Breed, as well as Mayor Shang Tao, and uh, to many other the dignitaries that are coming out, all of the artists, entrepreneurs, and all of that spirit. Let's just have a great time and let people know that, hey, we can come together. Once we band together, as, as Dr. King said, as you mentioned, I, I have a dream, you know, that all people, all races, all creeds, all genders, all likeness can come together and shine light in an area that they rock, that the rest of the world quite doesn't understand. We love that. And we see the cosmos in you. You're a star as well. And I love that he talks about connecting communities, Mayor yeah. London Breed and Mayor Shang Tao, working on solutions across two sides of the bridge. Thank you so much, Mr. Fab. Okay, 